right, I'm going into the garden for a spot of our fresco cooking this afternoon. Please come with me. Okay, ready to barbie. Now, these fish fillets will take hardly any time to cook. I'm going to put some foil on the barbecue because otherwise I find the fish just sticks to the wires and I don't want to mar the beauteousness of my fillets. Slap them down. Mm. And as quick as these are, I mean the shredded salad is even quicker. I mean one because of course there's no cooking and two because I've already chopped everything up. First, carrot. Some spring onions. Lovely. Hot red chilli pepper, although not as hot as it could be because I've taken the seeds out, so you get the heat but intense sweetness. And some green pawpaw, which looks a bit like cucumber but is much crunchier and nuttier. And now some really lovely pink raw peanuts, lovely and sweet, and really earthy, pungent coriander. So these just need to be roughly chopped. Okay, so I'm just going to add these and then attempt in my um, rather alarmingly clumsy way to turn over the fish. Be patient with me. It's just very difficult not to tear this lovely skin. Here goes again. You don't need to use red mullet, beautiful though these are, as you can see. Salmon fillets are fabulous too, a lovely coral. But chicken, anything you want, I mean, please. Okay, now, we've got all that lovely crunchy sweetness. So, we need a bit of sharpness to offset that. Lime, very sour. Just one, but squeeze out well. Mm. Some fish sauce, and it's this sharp note which makes the whole thing so refreshing and, if I may say so, very unfishily inviting. A bit of sugar to melt into the sourness of the fish sauce and lime. You need that, balances everything in life, in food. Stir. Well, we're done. Now I'm going to fight with my inner clumsy self and outer, I have to say, and get these lovely pink babies off the grill. And just strew with those lovely crunchy shards. Mm. Glass of cold beer and this fish. Mm.